Michael's first game back against the Pacers in Indianapolis. He was very candid about the fact that he had butterflies. Uh, he was very nervous about that particular game. He has calmed down since then, but I would think the butterflies are back for this one here tonight. But it's controlling the opening tip. Ewing feeling Purdue, and that is rejected. And here comes Kuko. Tony Kuko, who's picked it up the last couple of games for Michael Jordan, who fires. Yes. Michael Jordan hitting on his first field goal attempt. Armstrong for Jordan. And he shoots again. So Michael Jordan opens up by hitting his first two and a half gone by. And here's the post up by Jordan. Off the spin. Could he have made that look any easier with the giant step lacking lately? That kind of offensive rebounding and finish. X by one. Jordan again. Michael Jordan posting up John Starks half remaining in this first quarter. Michael Jordan off to the fast start this time to the pull up and he is on fire. Has checked in for the first time. That's Blunt with the ball. Blunt, a first-round draft pick of the Bulls last year out of University of Cincinnati. Jordan with 13 points. He's hit six of seven. That is also the matchup at the defensive end for the Knicks. Shot clock at seven. Jordan. Michael Jordan has the jump shot falling here tonight. Seven of nine, 15 points to post. Jordan against Bonner and Michael Jordan with 17 points to the last second whether the pass or not offers four or four for the line Jordan for three he certainly got the attention of, of Michael Jordan was very upset Michael Jordan able to drive on Greg Anthony early a number in his career and that also the uh, the number he wore in his uh, brief baseball tryout, Michael Jordan cuts it to 11. And now a mismatch with Pippen guarding Ewing. Bad pass. Jordan off the turnover. Puts the move on starts. Yes, and it counts. Michael Jordan. But he can fill his part for sure. Well, knowing Kevin Locker, he has the coach of the team. I think any coach, as we look at Jordan operate on Starks, would say something like that. Jordan gets ridiculous now <laughs> with that fall away one-hander. And he has done it with the complete repertoire. Michael, you're hogging the ball. There will be any complaints from <laughs> Phil Johnson or John. Again, Jordan isolated against Starks. And Michael Jordan continues to roll. That was two-point range. And the Knicks lead 66-57. Jordan gets inside. Easy hoop. Well, John Starks' teammates, Oakley and Ewing, weren't in tune with that situation. Let me go in the direction of Mr. Mason. Wanted a foul on Jordan. Looked like he was tripped up. He shoots for three. 42 for Michael Jordan. And he's tied the game at 73 for three. Rebound Jordan. Michael Jordan very upset with Pete Myers. And Jordan fires and hits. Three-pointer. Well, maybe Michael knew that this would be a special night in the shoot-around earlier today here at the Garden from half court. Michael able to hit and then did it again. In fact, two in a row is lead by five. Both clubs shooting well. Jordan serves up a variety of things offensively. A lot of driving and a lot of jump shooting. And Michael Jordan with 51 points. Plays 105. The Knicks 102. Step. 53 points for Michael 
Jordan, who is now deep in conversation with John Starks. 105 remaining. 9-2 run by the Knicks. Here is Pippen. Oh, he went last. Scotty Pippen makes it home. The Bulls by two, and the Knicks call for time. Jordan under a lot of pressure going baseline. A lot of pressure. Gives it up to his teammate who plays Michael Jordan, and he comes through a pick. Well, Ewing with 36 points. Armstrong handles against Harper. Jordan played very well by Starks. Good fake, though, and he has given the Bulls a 111-109 lead. The Knicks call for time, and that is a high for the NBA this season. 55 points by Michael Jordan. Game, the jump shot is back. Starks, and he draws the foul. John Starks trying to tie the game with 14 and 6 tenths seconds remaining in the fourth quarter. Knicks have one timeout left. Chicago, 220. Clutch free throw shooting by John Starks. The Knicks and the Bulls tied at 111. 14 and 6 tenths seconds to go. Chicago does have a full timeout of, and a 20 remaining. Knicks have one timeout left. Where's Jordan, the oh, Starks lost his footing here as Jordan in a surprise sets up Wennington. Three seconds to go. The Bulls by two. As you might expect to Jordan, who had the open man, and Bill Wennington with the stuff to give the Bulls the lead. Three and one ten seconds to go, and the bench of the Chicago Bulls exploding on that play. Well, it's going to be hard to make it to Ewing. It might have to be a jumper. Starks lost the handle, and that will do it. It's a backcourt violation. Chicago will take over. Eight tenths of a second remaining. And now Pippen will throw in. Eight tenths of a second left. All the Bulls have to do is touch it. They do, and that is it. The Chicago Bulls with a dramatic 113-111 victory over the New York Knicks. They are now within two games of the Cleveland Cavaliers. And they have taken two of three against the Knicks. Michael Jordan with a remarkable return to Madison Square Garden.